Cognate atrium is the term coined for complete calcification of the left atrium in chronic rheumatic valla heart disease. The stimulus for calcification could be the chronic inflammatory process of rheumatic fever as well as the strain due to atrial overload. Reduced left atrial compliance leads to elevation in pressures which gets transmitted to the pulmonary venous system, pulmonary arteries and sequentially to the right heart. Chest X-ray will show the calcified outline of the left atrium which can be further confirmed by CT scan. Cognate atrium has also been called as porcelain atrium akin to the porcelain iota. Presence of such extensive calcification is important in the setting of mitral valve surgery. Mitral valve replacement procedures and radiotherapy can also predispose to calcification. Cognate left atrium has been described 23 years after mitral replacement for chronic mitral stenosis, despite normal prosthetic mitral valve function, the patient had exertional dyspnea and severe pulmonary arterial hypertension. Cognate atrium can predispose to atrial fibrillation and systemic embolism. Another term applied to extensive left atrial calcification is mold-like calcification. Due to difficulty in replacing the mitral valve, Total endoatriectomy had to be done in a patient with mold-like calcification of left atrium. Endoatriectomy is an option when only an endocardial shell of calcification is present. When the entire left atrium up to the epicardium is calcified, accessing the left atrium for mitral valve replacement is almost impossible. Calcification may extend to the pulmonary veins. Preoperative knowledge on the extent of calcification of left atrium is important for the surgeon before deciding to operate on patient with long-standing mitral stenosis. First set of references on coconut atrium. Second set of references. Third set of references. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe, like, share and post your valuable comment below this video.